Hello guys, this is Puerto Rica and today I have another compensator or muscle break or whatever you want to call it, but something that's going to help me control that recoil at the end of the barrel. This compensator is mounted on my Glock 19 right now, but you can use it for any pistol that you have that have a threaded barrel. I want you to screw it in like righty tighty lefty loose. If it's one of those backward barrels, you won't be able to do it. So this compensator is by Harrington Arm and they make some cool loose looking compensator and magazine plates or magazine extensions. Uh, I want one of those too, so hopefully they send me one whenever they're in stock again because, because right now everybody's panic buying and buying everything that they can they can get their hands on. So how this works, you're gonna have a little block on front of your pistol and you're gonna have a hole on top and hole on the sides. So what the compensator does is you're gonna have a block, a little block on the front of the pistol or at the end of your barrel, which is gonna have three holes, one hole up and two to the side. So what this is gonna do is take out the blast for the round coming backward and pushing you down a little upwards what it's gonna do is gonna mitigate those gases up and to the sides therefore there's less force pushing you back therefore you have less recoil when shooting the round so now let's shoot our, our magazine real quick gun is hot Whoop, a little flinch right there. Now without shooting it that much right here on the range and not a lot of comparison, I can say that the Rico is a little bit less harsh. Therefore, it's gonna help me like shooting the gun pretty much. So yes, guys, you can definitely feel the difference. I can do like follow shots a little bit faster. I can feel more comfortable shooting. If you're a person that you cannot control the recoil a lot, at least for a nine millimeter, which shouldn't be a problem, but a little bit of help will never hurt anyone. I mean, this is helping me do those follow shots super fast, being more accurate because I had to worry a little bit less about that recoil. Therefore, I'm not flinching as much. Like I said in any video, I'm not an expert about guns or shooting. I'm just sharing my journey through this and having that less recoil is helping me not to think about flinching a lot. Then I can be a little bit more accurate, even though I still flinch and jerk my trigger and miss the target, that's normal to happen. I'm not an aimbot or anything like that. That. This is a short review. I haven't shot thousands of rounds through this compensator, so I can give you a full review. There are other people that do that. But I took this compensator a couple of times to the range, and so far it's working great. Would I recommend this? I would say yes. Like, if you need like, to control that recoil a little bit more, or if you're an experienced shooter and you want to be even better, this tool is going to definitely help you a little bit more to be faster and more accurate. This is my second compensator, and I like it. I mean, it looks super good in the gun. The size is not terribly big. Even though I would not consider carry this, I carry appendix position and then that extra length right there. It's gonna make it feel like a full size pistol. I don't think I'm into that, but I will definitely take it to the range, have some fun, shoot a little bit faster. And for my home defense gun, I will definitely do it. I was shooting some ball ammunition, 115 grains, and the gun cycle without a problem. So I will say it works works for me. I shoot about 200 rounds today and I didn't have any malfunctions so it's working great for me. If you want to check this compensator out, find more information, order your own, you can go to harringtonarms.com. I will leave a link on the description below and you can also buy the base plates or magazine extension that they sell and everything they're doing is looking pretty slick and pretty cool. So I will highly recommend you to click that link below. If you like this video, please hit the like button below. Please subscribe and see you till next time. Thank <laughs> you.